Bob Hillebert Sportswear Short Track Super Series. We need you to get off your seat and on your feet. Get something bright. Get out your lights. Wave it for your favorite. If you don't have one, pick one out. Root them on. 200 laps. $53,000 on the line here for the Bob Hilbert Sportswear Short Track Super Series fueled by Zenoco. The Modifieds are ready to dance. The Speed Showcase 200 is underway here at the Port Royal Speedway. Alex Yankowski, he's going to be your early leader as cars jockeying for position here on the opening lap. Four wide through the middle of the pack. Matt Williamson, Max McLaughlin, Billy Pouch Jr. and Mike Maresco were four wide, but all for the corner. Lap number one will go to Kid Rocket. Alex Yankowski will lead the field here for the first of 200 laps. And we will quickly go yellow the two of Billy Van Pelt up in the fence. Your leaders in heavy, heavy lap traffic and early in this one. And amazing how quickly Jankowski's lead shrunk. It was up to almost two seconds. Now Matt Williamson to the bottom side through one and two for the first time in the Speed Showcase 200. You've got a new leader. It's money, Matt Williamson. And now Matt Shepard, he's going to move up into that runner-up spot. Yeah, Shepard saw a hole and he hit it. Jankowski drifted up the racetrack and Shepard took second to Danny Buck trying to follow him. Buck will move to the bottom of Jankowski for the third spot. Jankowski will hold him off and meanwhile, here comes McLaughlin. McLaughlin reeling in, Buck for fourth. Absolutely, four cars battling for that second spot. There goes Danny Buck. He has a run on the outside of Jankowski and what a run. He is absolutely gonna power around the 84 wide. But wait a minute, here comes Jankowski through the middle, but look who's running on the bottom. Here comes Mad Max McLaughlin. McLaughlin with a good run through three and four. Three wide down the front stretch for the third spot. Jankowski's in the middle. Bucks way up on the top side. McLaughlin down on the bottom. Meanwhile, the zero of Neil Williams is pulled off the speedway. Stuart Friesen's march, meanwhile, it continues to go. He will drive underneath of Larry White. That's a battle for the 14th position. Ryan Godown and Mike Maresca battling on your home, on your screens at home here on Dirt Track Digest TV. But here comes Stu driving underneath of Billy Pouch Jr. Stu trying to grab 13th away. Friesen working down low. Billy Pouch is on the outside of him as we're about to go three wide. Just look how low the 44 of Friesen is running. He, that is where he's most definitely, that obviously is the shortest way around here at Port Royal Speedway as he's going to look to the bottom side of Mikey Maresca in the 20. They battle for that position side by side in turn three. As we have a car getting upside down in turn number four, the red flag will come out. Car flipping wildly there in turn number four. He's climbing out of the car. Absolutely. Billy Pouch Jr. getting out of that car underneath his own power. So a great sight there. Billy Pouch Jr. climbing out of the car after the hard contact. Looks like maybe the steering broke as he went head on into the outside guardrail. Just a hard, hard hit. When they get back on the loud pedal, and it is now green flag is out, and the Speed Showcase 200 is back underway. And the turns one and two, Shepard hanging with Williamson into the corner. Williamson gets the bite off of the top side, and he will clear Shepard down the back straightaway. Meanwhile, battle for third, McLaughlin and Yankowski side by side. Yankowski will make that pass and put the 84Y back up to third. Here comes your leader, Matt Williamson. Friesen, what does Friesen do? He's going to follow Danny through the middle, swing high. We're almost three wide. Friesen going in no man's land. Friesen makes it work off of the top side of turn number four. He drives around Danny Buck. Now deep into one and two. Still will drive to the sixth position. Stuart Friesen is a man on a mission right now. Absolutely. Some cars up front now making their way to the pits, including the 44 of Stuart Friesen. So Friesen after driving from the back all the way to third. All right, that's a 20 now heading to the hot pit along with the 43, Jimmy Horton, the 20, Mike Maresca. The Perego bringing them back down to the green flag. Williamson in three is gonna duck down low of Perego, try to find some bite there through the slick. Can't quite make that move as Perego, he's gonna go back up high. Here comes Matt Williamson. Joey Chris with the green and white checkered flag off of turn number four, this time by 
And that will go to Anthony Perego. He leads at the halfway point. Matt Williamson, Matt Shepard, Max McLaughlin, and Peter Britton, the top five. So with just eight cars staying on the track here at the halfway break, they will be the top eight. They're all on the lead lap. So they will be the top eight when we go back to racing. The four of Andy Bichetti will inherit the lead. The 1K of Rick Laubach will be second. See some last minute adjustments happening there to the left front shock tower there on Matt Williamson's race car. So they're doing uh, some last minute, Adjust making some last minute adjustments. <laughs> right. For the second 100 laps, now it's time to go win $53,000. Green flag, we are back underway. Good start from Bichetti. He will clear Lobach. Here comes Ryan Watt. Watt off of the top side will drive around Stuart Friesen. Watt out of nowhere from 41st now to third, taking advantage using some strategy. Ryan Watt trying to steal $53,000. However, the 44 of Friesen not letting him go just yet as Ryan Watt is going to work back up to the top side there in turn number two. The 44 of Friesen not letting him go, however. Watt and Friesen side by side for the two spot. Friesen will drive underneath of Wadi. He will take the two spot back as they're both around Rick Lalbach. They'll go to second and third. McKetty working down low, tries to make the car real wide, but he's not going to deny the 44. And Stuart Friesen is going to take the lead down the back stretch. Dewey officially staking his claim now. He will take the lead here five laps into the second half of this feature. We got 95, make it 94 to go. Watt hanging right with him, but they both caught Shepard. Shepard breaks here on the front straightaway. The 9S coming to a stop here on the front stretch. Unbelievable turn of events as the caution flag is going to come out. Yeah, checking in here on the nine of Shepard. They've taken both rear tires off here. Definitely a left rear flat, like you said, guys. But just checking over the shocks here before they get ready to send it back out. A tough break here for the nine. Guys. Off of the bottom side, Williamson will pull up alongside Perego. Williamson trying to grab that two spot away. Perego, meanwhile, continuing to roll up towards the top of the racetrack. With Perego starting to lose some bite, here comes Williamson off of the bottom. Williamson showing some strength in the one in the three, working the bottom side of Perego. He will take that second spot away. Side by side as they make the way into one. Down into the corner, Friesen will drive to the bottom. He'll drift up the racetrack. Williamson tries to roll the middle off of turn number two. Side by side for the lead. Here comes Money Matt. Matt Williamson hauls the middle into turn number three. Friesen not letting him go. They're side by side as they make their way off of turn number four. And Matt Williamson will take the lead. Just when you thought Friesen was going to walk away with it, Matt Williamson continues to show his prowess. Matt Williamson has never won a short track Super Series race. Boy, oh boy, would this be the one to do it as Williamson starts to pull away. That's McLaughlin and the 9S of Matt Shepard duking it out. Shepard's going to take fourth. Yeah, McLaughlin moved into Shepard's line. Shepard had to go to the bottom to get by him, but he does. Shepard now to fourth. If there is a yellow, the 9S might be the man to beat. Matt Shepard is flat out on the move. He's to fourth. His money, Matt Williamson, as Anthony Perego and Matt Shepard still duke it out for that third spot. Shepard pulls alongside Perego. He'll drive around him for third, but the white flag will wave. Matt Williamson leading the way. Williamson, he's looking to get his first career win as Friesen taps the guardrail once again. It turns number three and four. Here comes Money Matt looking to make history. Williamson home free off of turn number four. $53,000. We call it money for a reason. Double checkered flag to Matt Williamson. Stuart Friesen second. Matt Shepard third. Anthony Perigo fourth. And a late range charge. Larry White the top five. But they're going to let him out of the car. He can hear you. Money, Matt Williamson is $53,000 richer. Earning his first career short track Super Series modified event 